So Uranus is a very unique planet in the solar system. And the interesting thing about Uranus is Uranus is its rotational axis. At 97 degrees, it rotates on its side. It's believed that Uranus probably was hit by a very large object in the early days of the solar system of after its formation. Probably something the, about the size of the Earth or perhaps bigger. So as a result of that collision, Uranus was knocked on its side. So it r rolls around the solar system like a bowling ball. And um, its atmosphere is mainly consisting of hydrogen and helium with some ammonia, ammonia and methane and water in the atmosphere, water ice. It's the coldest of all the planets in the solar system, especially the outer planet. It's the coldest and probably has the least amount of activity in its atmosphere. There are thunderstorms there just like on the other gas giants in here on Earth, but they only occur between in the middle latitudes the, the equivalency to where the storms occur on Uranus on Earth would be between the Tropic of Capricorn and the Tropic of Cancer. That region, the equivalency to that on Earth is where the storms reside on Uranus. And you only see them on the side of Uranus that faces the Sun. Even though Uranus is the furthest out, and the sun's energy probably would do minimal to cause or to encourage the development of thunderstorms. And it's not entirely known 100% as to why that is, being that Uranus is so far out in the solar system to see lightning. But you only see it in the side of the atmosphere that receives sunlight. You don't see it in the dark side, on the dark end of Uranus. So you only see it over the northern, the southern pole, because it's the southern, it's the, you only see it over the, um, the southern pole of Uranus, or the northern pole, excuse me. So Uranus is a, kind of a freak show of the solar system, but, um, but we're going to talk more about the planets in future videos. We're going to tackle Titan next, so stay tuned.